What's up? This... Oh, that was actually a godlike like, All right, stomp. so Falcon... Falcon destroys Ices. Yeah, he pretty much plays every single character, so... He can choose uh, who he wants. His Falcon's to. not half bad. I would say his Falcon's like his second or third best character. He's... Yeah, Falcon is... You really have to mess up to get punished by Ice Counters. I mean, that's pretty much every character, but specifically Falcon. He's just so good versus... Like, literally, if you just knee and I'll cancel, like... <laughs> it's so hard for them to do anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Vetlis back in the week. That'd be pretty cool. You get another good player. Oh, my God. The stomps. The back airs. I, I want to see some side Bs after... Ooh. Yeah, like, Billy... He would have been entered in the bracket without actually paying. <laughs> At AEX. Oh, like, my God, dude. How? Like, how's that happen? I don't know. Oh, that's it. Oh, I've nope. heard Nino's good at this matchup. Yeah, he's getting bodies right now, to be honest. I don't know who told me that, but somebody. I think Brian, maybe. Yeah. I don't think Penny's specifically good at this matchup, though. Doesn't he, like. Didn't he lose the Fuji Bean or something? And I think Fuji Bean's no, he like destroyed the. destroyed Fuji Bean. But... Did he? Yeah. No, he force stocks Fuji Bean. Oh, shit. He was, like, not close. Oh. I remember, because, like. We always make fun of Brian for being a wobbling monkey, and like, Fuji Bean's the wobbling chimp. So <laughs> they're like, they're like they're brothers. brothers. <laughs> yeah, it's all about the quesadilla. Dude, that stream was so lit. So I, I, it's like, what is this? I kind of hated that Brian didn't actually follow up with the stream. I know. There wasn't a second one. Oh, he's dead. Oh. No. Dude, Falcon's up B is uh, pretty good horizontally. According to Wumpus, Falcon is the best recovery. Wumpus is... I'm, I'm sorry, Wump. I'm I don't sorry, think he actually Wump. said that, but You're an it idiot, seems like dude. something he'd say. Dude. I think he's kind of like mocking Johnny Gamble, honestly. I think he's sort of mocking Johnny Gamble, who Johnny Gamble is mocking... Um, Ladandis. Ladandis. Don't bring that West Coast shit over here, dude. I don't think Johnny Gamble actually thinks Falcon's that bad. Falco? Like, I think at this point, it's kind of just like a meme that he's like thinks Falcon destroys that cheap. Yeah, I know you never said that, but it sounds like something you said. It's say. something you would definitely say. <laughs> As a trick. We know you're not that dumb. Mmm. <laughs> Nino's bringing this back in. <laughs> yeah, he is. Strike to Yoshi's. I feel like this would be good for Falcon. Well, no, it's definitely good yeah. for Falcon, dude. Because, like, you don't even have to get them in really kill a percentage to actually kill them. Like,. You saw that match with uh, Wizzy Nintendo, dude, where he was at like 20%, and he punished a roll with a yeah, double knee. Like yeah, yeah, and just killed him. At uh, Dreamhack. Yeah, it's just because the blast zones are so close. Yeah, he's just had pretty good kill options as well. But... And Falcon's so heavy, too. Like, I'm pretty sure Bobby lived to like 130 last stock. Yeah, so pro tip to everyone playing Ice Climbers, if you aerial Nano off stage, she's going to immediately double jump. So just cool. guess. Just guess when she's going to double jump. Double jump. Some of the things Nino does, it's like, why? Like, why would he not just wobble there? I think he so messed up somehow because yeah. he like popped out. Oh, oh. he baited him out of shield. I'm pretty sure that F smash is not that bad because it pulls back and it's also unpunishable on shield. I think. Oh, he did it again. Huh? <laughs> He's baiting in in the shield grabbing and then just punishing with F smash. I feel like Nino's Sopo is pretty good. Mostly because he doesn't rely on wobbling that much. I think Falcon is Mars only losing matchup. Dude, there's not even a Falcon in this region that's that good against Mars, dude. I think Sheik. You think Sheik is like a... Sheik, yeah. I think it's... I don't think it's bad, but I do think Sheik slightly wins. I think Mars slightly wins. Really? Yeah, he's just better in neutral. Yeah, I can see it. So, I don't know, a lot of people argue about that matchup. I think Marth Fox is the most even matchup out of all the top tiers. Yeah, I can see that. I think Marth Fox are two best characters. Definitely. So he doesn't strike FD. So we neutral start? It's FD though. I think he struck out Fountain. Fountain's good for Falcon in this matchup. Though. Um because of Stomp dude. I don't think I don't think Bobby really plays like super platform based. He kinda does like a grounded Okay. Grounded double jump kinda uh playstyle. And you would think he would use pop <sighs> That looks so cool. I just love it when Falcon just super destroys Ices while they're shielding. It's like it's actually like sadistically satisfying to watch. I don't hate Ice Climbers that much. No, I don't hate Ice Climbers either. I think they're terrible. 
I think like they're just a really bad character. You hate ice climbers. No, I don't. I really don't. What character do you hate? None. Like none of them. Um, I hate Luigi. <laughs> Everyone character. hates Luigi. Uh, I hate Luigi and Sheik. So, I think the character that I think is the dumbest is Sheik. Because specifically for me, I have to work so hard in that matchup to get anything good as a punish. And like, she just does down throw into whatever she, whatever her, whatever her hope and dreams oh. are. That sucks. Yeah, um, and uh, I think the character I actually hate is Ness because he's just so terrible. Like anyone who plays Ness, they just actually can't do some, some like things sometimes. It's Jim Jam sometimes pretty good. Yeah, he should have banned FD. I feel like. I think Nino's saying I'm going FD all day, <laughs> all day. Dude, I don't know. I feel like when you're playing on. You know, he's dropped a couple what you said there. is literally true about Falcon. That's not true at all, dude. Marth has a great punish game on Falcon. Yeah, Marth's punish called, game's not that great on Sheik. It's like, called throw him off stage, and he literally can't do anything. You kind of have to, uh, like, in order to punish Sheik, you have to make the read, I feel like. Mm. You got to get that jump. Away. It's it's about the getting the jump, and also uh, you have to kind of work a specific percentage game. More so than other characters like Spacey's, you have to like up throw at 30 or 60 percent. Otherwise, you gotta like get her off stage or stuff. That was convincing for Nina. Three stock. So what is he down now? I don't think Falcon's down throw fair is hype. Bam. I think Falcon's a boring character. Bam Battlefield. Mm. No, I think Stadium Ban. Right? It's kind of like FD though. I don't know. I know Brian thinks the battlefield is ice climbers worst stage just overall. Why do you say that? Because the platform heights? I'm not sure, honestly. Yet. I would think the platform heights, probably. Yeah, maybe. The platform heights are pretty good at avoiding. It's like, they can't time. short hop up air through through them, like, constantly. Because of, like, they, they'll poke through a little bit, and then, like, the hammers will come down. Because the platforms are just a tiny Should bit too high. Battlefield. Yeah, I agree. I think battlefield probably is the band. Oh, oh so he that was not a good stomp. Yeah, that was... I know Dimension loves this stage against Ice Climbers, I think. Yeah, dude, he destroyed Ryan on this stage. Or too great. I think Dreamland's a great stage here as Ice Climbers. <laughs> Is David screaming? I bet he's watching this right now. <laughs> what do you think he's about Dreamland? He's like every wobble, but he always gets it. What do you think about Dreamland versus Ice Climbers? I think it's actually a great stage. I think it's good for Mars. Yeah. You, like, never... Like, I just hate that feeling of, like, getting hit... A bunch by ice climbers like you're just like stuck in there like uh what's that thing called where they like spray you ice. spray you blizzard <laughs> yeah. like, when they spray you <laughs> i couldn't think of that word. <laughs> it's not that funny it's actually hilarious <laughs> but like getting you didn't see it but like he did a hand motion to describe <laughs> what, like, what he was talking about <laughs> and he just puts his hand out and he's just <laughs> like he, he sprayed you with something <laughs> i couldn't think of that word. <laughs> Oh my god. I that was hilarious. His back, though. Got wobbled right off the bat. Oh god, that DI was He just needs to spam back air and knee more. He's doing too much neutral air. Right, they so can't dimensions. camp on their platforms on Dreamland? Best stage. I hate Dreamland, but I think it's kind of even. What? The reason I like Dreamland is just that you have so much space to work with. I like. I don't like being like confined against Ice Climbers. <laughs> Wow. You I just know, feel like the, the majority of ice climbers you play before like actual good ones, like their neutral is bad. They're just really good at the at the decent setups. Yeah, so I think bigger stages like works in your favor versus most ice climber players. Ice climbers is that bad neutral though. Like their neutral is just so bad. Yeah. But the thing the thing about lesser ice climber players, they um they're worse at mixing up what they do in neutral. Yeah. That's With true. the limited tools they have they're not that good at mixing up. Like Nino, Nino's main main neutral approach versus Marth when he played against me was just wave dash down smash. I mentioned saying he likes Battlefield. He oh says, wow! Well, he just likes Battlefield. Uh, wall jump. I like Yoshi's against Ice Climbers as Marth, which is kind of hypocritical because I just said I don't like being confined, but 
I think Marth kind of destroys us by his own issues. It's the slant. They can't, like, sweet spot. Ooh, he's dead. Nino bringing it back. Pretty convincing game one for Metal Reaper, but uh, Nino kept it together pretty well. Yeah. So that puts Nino, he plays you. Nino plays me? I think so. 